Welcome to a morning yoga for better posture. Let's get right into it. We will begin in child's pose. Knees are together or apart. Forehead to the mat. Gently rotate your neck back and forth, releasing any tension in your neck. Now press in on both palms, make your way into an all fours position. Hips over knees, shoulders directly over ankles, neutral spine. Lifting up out of your wrists. To begin, we will inhale, taking a cow stretch. Belly button drops towards your mat. Shine the chest between your shoulder blades, gazing up. So there's a nice C shape in your back. Exhaling into cat, round your spine, belly button goes in the opposite direction, drawing it to the sky, tuck your tailbone, release through your neck, looking like a scary Halloween type cat. Back to neutral. Now we will move through a few rounds of these, but I would like you to move at the pace of your own breath, really moving with intention. So we inhale, belly button down, Heart opens. Round your spine. Relax through your neck. Moving with your breath now. Maybe that is faster or slower. Maybe you stay in cat an extra few moments and rock your neck back and forth. Maybe in cow, you move your hips to the right and then to the left. Let it be fluid and free. This is one of the best poses for resetting the spine. So it's a great posture fix. Beautiful. Finish one more round. And when you're done, we'll meet in a neutral spine. Let's turn our core and our glutes on. Begin by sending your left leg out long, lifting up out of your wrist. Hips stay aligned. So we aren't trying to open our hips when we lift them up. Core is switched on. Glutes are firing. We're not sinking into our lower back. If you feel stable here, add on by extending your right arm out long. Gazes down. Both shoulders stay aligned. Palm facing the ground. Breathing deeply. One more breath. Beautiful. Release. Reset. You can take a cat or a cow here. Let's do that on the other side. Checking in with our alignment, hips over knees, shoulders over wrists. Extending your right leg out this time. Notice if you've opened through your hips. We aren't trying to lift the leg as high as possible. Nice long spine. Adding on if we feel stable by lifting your left arm and sending it out long. Our gaze is down so we have a nice straight spine. Keep your glutes and core engaged. If you need to put your arm back down because you're sinking into your low back, please do. Final breath. 
and release, good. Pressing into your palms, tuck your toes and lift the hips back up into downward facing dog. Pressing through each fingertip. Take a bend in your knees to get your spine long and straight. Bend so much that your torso rests on your thighs and then draw your heels towards the earth. Look to the top of your mat and make your way there. Folding over your legs when you arrive. Bend in your knees a lot if you need to. We want a long, tall spine. Weight is in the ball of your feet. Relax through your neck. Reach your arms overhead as we stand tall and exhale, they fall to your side, good. We will take a wide leg forward fold. So you may need to step out lengthways on your mat so the feet are wider than hips distance. Toes facing out straight. Evenly distribute the weight into your feet and hands to your hips. Inhale. As you exhale, we fold forward, leading from our hearts. Palms can meet the ground in front of you. Micro bend in the knees as needed. Your kneecaps are facing up and out. Long spine. Don't round through your spine to get lower. For this practice, we want to focus on the spine being as straight as possible. You can experiment with grabbing the feet or aligning the palms to your ankles, maybe gently shaking the head out. One more breath. Palms to the ground if they aren't already. Halfway lift. Return the palms to your hips. Engage the core and glutes to lift out tall. Nice. Back to the top of your mat. Inhaling, arms reach up. And exhale, swan dive forward. Arms go wide, lead from your heart. Inhale, halfway lift to a tall spine. Palms can come to your shins. And exhale, fold forward. Palms root into the mat. On your inhale, step back into plank. Shoulders over wrists. Exhale, lower yourself to the mat. Palms under shoulders to begin. Palms under shoulders to begin. Elbows tuck into your body as you inhale, lift your chest off the mat. Exhale, lower back down. Inhale again, baby cobra. And you lower on your exhale. Inhale, baby cobra, engage your glutes. Maybe you lift your hands off the mat this time. And exhale, lower. Finding our full expression of cobra or upward dog. Arms extend as you inhale. Chest shines forward. You can lift the tops of your thighs off the mat if it feels okay in your back. Drop your shoulders away from your ears. And exhale, make your way back to down dog. Return your knees to the ground. Take child's pose. Great work. Return to this practice if you want to consistently improve your posture while also strengthening and stretching your entire body. Have a beautiful day.